Hello guys, and today I'm going to eat a Yule Log, well part of some of it anyway. This is a triple chocolate Yule Log by Cadbury, and on the back it also mentions reindeer cakes. Now, as I said on a separate video, I did a video of me eating some of their chocolate reindeer cakes, okay? And it's got nothing to do with reindeers in them. They don't have like, you know, dead reindeer in them or reindeer meat or anything like that. So you don't need to worry, guys, if any of you are vegan or anything like that. Well, I think this might be vegetarian food, but that's another matter. But you know what I mean. Anyway, um, this is a Cadbury Yule Lock. It's basically a Swiss roll with icing on top essentially and covered with chocolate and it also happens to be out of date by approximately a month here you'll notice it says the 1st of December 2022 it is currently Christmas Day which is the 25th of December um, recently on the BBC website today they the BBC posted a video of Rishi Sunak our Prime Minister um, feeding, um, serving food to a homeless man in a homeless centre, okay? And them talking about business, apparently, and asking him what he did or things like that, okay? Now, I couldn't possibly have known that a month ago, okay? So, um, that proves it's genuinely out of date food, okay? Now, it wasn't my intention to have this out of date, believe it or not. Um, I actually just bought it for, yes, it's a chocolate, um, essentially switch roll. I mean, it's, they call it a Yule Log, but, you know, it's practically the same thing, pretty much. Um, it's a Swiss roll doesn't normally have, um, completely, isn't normally covered completely in chocolate, and it also isn't, um, covered with icing at the top, but anyway. So now... I'm going to eat it and I'm going to see what it's like, okay? Alright, now. I'm going to open it at this end. Hopefully it's the right end. Now, I'm going to show you the Yule Log, okay? As see, on these, which are... It's basically, um, these are provided every year, pretty much, by different companies. And only at Christmas time, usually, so... You can buy Swiss rolls throughout the year, but they don't ha not, aren't normally covered in completely in chocolate. And also, they don't have the icing on. So now, I have here a plate, and I also have a knife. So I'm going to... Let's wait a minute. I'm going to... Pull back some of this. I'm now going to cut a slice it out, and I'm going to cut another slice, because I not slice it not. My second slice was a bit more firmer, so you can see this chocolate on the outside, and you can see what's the Swiss roll on the inside essentially. It consists of chocolate icing. With chocolate sponge and also chocolate um, coating on the outside, okay? This is the end, so you see the chocolate coating. This is the other side, which is the Swiss roll, and some of the chocolate has fallen off, to be honest, on this particular one. Some of the chocolate has fallen off the edge, so there you go. Right, guys, now. I'm not going to have all of it, obviously. I'm just going to probably have a cut, have one or two slices. So this picked off. It's picked off the edge of. This one is the edges are starting to fall off. So just the edge. So this is just the chocolate bit itself. Okay. Okay. It's one month out of date. It seems okay to me. Now, 
and you have to sun the sponge bit on its own. So I'm going to just a bit of a sponge on its own just to see what some of the sponge is like it's out of date. It seems edible. No, it would be nice if it was fresh, I'm not sure, but it seems okay to me. And I'm going through to complete science. And the trouble is, the, the topic keeps falling off, so... That's just about the only annoying thing about it, really. It has a very rich taste, so it's very, very chocolatey, but very rich. So, some people might consider it a bit too sweet. And some people might consider it a bit slightly sickly, I don't know. It might be because of the icing sugar. It might be too sweet for some people's taste. It might even be slightly too sweet for my taste, I don't know, but there you go. Now, a long, long time ago, when I was a child at school, we had catering lessons, okay? And, um, of course we are, um, we were trying to create gender equality. Boys also had to take part in the cooking lessons. And we had to make one of these at school. You know, using raw ingredients, okay? You have to make our own mule log at school out of raw ingredients, okay? It was a long, long time ago. To be honest, since we made one at school, I never made any again, to be honest. I never made any Swiss rolls myself, so there you go, but... Not from school. So... I remember roughly how we did it, but I can't remember completely how we did it, to be very honest, okay? Right, so, would I have it again? I think I have had it again. To be honest, I'm just a bit disappointed, a bit too rich in my opinion, but other than that, it's okay. Okay, guys, I'm going to put the rest of this back now, so. Put it back in the box in the, in the plastic wrapper. Um, and I'm going to put that back in the box. So there you go guys, nearly one month out of date, you'll log, okay? Thanks for watching, bye!